important stuff today. Doing cereals. Ah! First up, we've got the Cheerio. Fucking hell, it's, it's up there. One of them that you don't need sugar, but it does succumb to the sog. Very quickly. I'm gonna put B, just because of the sog factor. Alright, and you all know what I mean. It's one of them cereals that I do give it credit, you don't need added sugar. Um, but your variants are more popular. You know, your Honey Cheerio, for example. That shits all over the original. You know, it's like Godfather 2. So B. Cocoa Pops and Milk make a bowl full of fun. Is that the thing? For me, the only thing with Cocoa Pops is there's a sweet spot. You don't want it just after you've poured the milk on, but you don't want to wait too long because then you've got a soggy mess on your spoon. But God, that chocolate milk, am I right? But you've just got to wait that sweet spot with them where the crunch is still there, but the milk is sort of absorbed as well. For that reason, it's going A, because it's better than Cheerios. I mean, fucking hell, come off it. Cookie crisp? Love a cookie crisp. They are crisp for a long time in that milk. And as we know by Cheerios and Cocoa Pops, that's very hard to do. So you've got to give them props for that. Taste-wise... If they tasted anything remotely like a cookie, I might be more impressed, but for me it's false advertising, and we don't support that at all here on the Nothing Channel. Um, I thought it were a fad, to be honest, when I was younger, but it's here to stay. It's B. You're not a cookie. You're not a cookie. You might have the rest of them on, but not me. Cornflakes. <laughs> Vanilla is to ice cream what cornflakes is to cereal. You know, you're bog standard, you're basic, you need sugar. The shit, D. I know there's going to be a lot of oldies out there um, questioning that. You know, they've been brought up on cornflakes and whatever. I get it. But just get some Frosties and don't tell me you don't add sugar because you're lying. You sit there and have a plain bowl of cornflakes and tell me you're excited about getting up that day. You're not. You're not. D. Dead. D for dead. You know, maybe a bit of full fat milk might save it, but still, the core taste ain't there, pal. Okay, Golden Nuggets, great advertisements, first of all, as a child. I remember they were, like, episodic, almost, with the Prospector and a donkey, I think. Again, Golden Nuggets, great, great taste. Great taste, no doubt about it. It's the sog time. They go soggy way too quick, and once they're soggy, they're gone with Golden Nuggets. There's some cereals out there that that's not the case for which we will go into shortly. But for the golden nugget, you need them crisp for them to be... God, you know, there's a moment where they're half sogged and half hard, uh, and you don't really know what it is. They don't even know what they are. If it's left in the milk too long, it's almost like they start coming apart. So, good, but for brief time. So, see. Oh, Nesquik. I fucking love Nesquik, me. I'm going to go S straight up, and I'm going to tell you why. Nesquik doesn't succumb to sog, okay? And if it is, you're eating it too slowly. All right. The milk is, dare I say, even more chocolatey than with the Cocoa Pops. You know, they've got the character there in the bunny, the Nesquik bunny. You leave it on side for 10 minutes, go for a walk around and have a still a solid crunch. Oreos. I threw this Oreo O's, should I say. Terrible name. So the Oreo O's have the chocolate loops, a little bit similar to the Weeto, and then they have the white filling as these little discs. The only problem with it is you've got two completely different consistencies and it shows when you're chowing down on that and you're getting the crunch of that and the softness of that. Ah, God, it just don't work. The flavour's all right and the milk's all right after, but I think you could almost do them as two separate cereals. It's that apparent that they're so different. I never understood this mix and match and fucking this, that. You know, make a cereal that's one cereal. For that, it's going D with your fucking cornflakes. Have some of that. Rice Krispies. Dead. Rice Krispies are flat out dead without any sugar on them, so um, they're just naff. Like the Cocoa Pops, they're up here because of the chocolatey taste and the chocolatey goodness. Rice Krispies don't have any of that. But I don't think it deserves to be on cornflakes, because when, when you put a little bit of sugar on, you know, they're very nice. So probably Golden Nuggets. Yeah. Oh, Weetabix Crispy Minis Chocolate Chip Edition. <sighs> Bosh. And I'll tell you why. Survives in the milk for days, weeks. And very, very rare, this. 
very rare for a cereal. It gets better the softer it gets. Imagine. Imagine a world where we could make more cereals like that. That's a world I want to live in. Sign me up. You know, make a cereal that's one cereal. 